Yes, let me, and let me clarify. The Italy IFD staff member did not apprehend the suspect. He just confronted him in the cafeteria, and that is when the suspect fled. The suspect was apprehended uh, outside of the cafeteria area while still on school grounds. Um, as to exactly what the confrontation was and the apprehension, uh, this is still obviously an extremely fluid and ongoing investigation, and we're not going to be releasing any of the details uh, of the actual investigation at this time. Is the suspect cooperating answering questions? I have not uh, visited with the detectives that are working that portion. I couldn't tell you if he was or wasn't, but right now, again, we wouldn't be releasing any uh, in information of, of, of the case. Sheriff, uh, is, is there a relation between the victim and the shooter that you all know of, an ex-girlfriend situation? Or anything like I'm not aware of any relationship that they have, but again, if that was to be a detail of the investigation, we wouldn't be releasing it. Did, I, want, I want to get back. Did, did that yes. clarify what you were saying? Yes, what you did. Thank you so much. The suspect, of course, is under age 16, but do you know of what charges he's facing? At this particular point, we do not know what charges uh, he will be facing. Obviously, there are charges that fit with what we know right now, but we don't know the extent of those charges uh, until we finish the investigation. And it was law enforcement who apprehended him? It was law enforcement that apprehended him. Was your office? I'm sorry? From your office? We're not going to be releasing the information as to, to which office. Was he hiding under a bench or something? I'm not familiar with whether he was hiding under a bench. Uh, again, that would be a detail of the investigation, and we haven't completed the investigation yet. Does it look like the victim was the target here? The, does I'm sorry? The girl who was hit was the intended target? That would be uh, a speculation on my part at this time because the investigation has not been concluded. At this point, we don't know a student. I'm sorry? A motive? I, I'm not aware of a motive at this time. Was he a natural student? I'm sorry? He was enrolled? He was an actual student? It is my understanding, and, and the superintendent can get to that one, but it's my understanding that both of them were actually enrolled students of Italy ISD. Sheriff, was he known to any law enforcement in or around Italy? I'm sorry? Was he known, was the suspect known? Does he have any kind of criminal, not criminal background or anything like that? Is he known to y'all? Do y'all know him? I, I'm not aware of it, but again, at, at the sheriff's office, I might not, and I couldn't tell you whether Italy PD is aware of him or have, has uh, dealt with him before or not. I, I couldn't tell you. We do not know where he got the firearm at this time. Sheriff, uh, several students that we talked to said that they had been made aware that there was some kind of threat, that something was going to happen at the school today. Were your uh, deputies aware of any such threat? I'm not aware of any such threats uh, that have been made. And again, that would be part of the ongoing investigation, and we're not going to be releasing details. We have one victim. Sure. And again, that we have one victim. And again, that would be a detail of the investigation, and we will not be releasing any details of the investigation. Thank you. All right, guys. Thank you for your time.